Today in the Tasting Mobile 2.0, I figure out what breakfast these fast food companies are pushing out. back and better than ever. Thank you, Eric Bischoff. Um, and I'm in a new tasting mobile, tasting mobile 2.0. I recently uh, got a new car. So we got a little bit new setup here. Um, but I hope it delivers the same great uh, nostalgic feelings that the original tasting mobile did. You're going to notice a few changes heading forward. First thing, that intro is going to stay the same. Um, it's just a lot to edit a new intro every single time. And it will allow me to get more content out because it will save time on editing. But with that said, that's enough. We got to get to the food. Uh, today we are doing promo FOMO. We are doing some breakfast, breakfast, I don't know what I just said, breakfast food. Um, and I hear Hardy's got a little something going on and Krispy Kreme got a little something going on. I haven't been to Krispy Kreme in a while. So we're going to hit up those two spots, see what breakfast items they're pushing out. And with no further ado, let's get rolling. And we're about to smash some breakfast. We got Hardee's first. They had two new things on their menu. So um, it was all chicken inspired, which you guys know I'm a huge fan of. One is the waffle sandwich and one is the regular chicken and biscuit. Or yeah, chicken biscuit, not chicken and biscuit. Um, so let's start with that. I think, yes, we got the chicken biscuit. We're gonna open her on up. Oh no, this is the waffle. There's the waffle first. I, I couldn't tell. It said chicken biscuit. Let me open this up. Oh, the smell. Oh, that is radiant. Oh. All right. We're not going to eat that first. That That's the grand finale. We're not going to be disrespectful. We'll do the normal chicken biscuit first. So bring it on back. Oh, no. I'm dropping crumbs in the mobile for the first time. She is grown. This is a grown woman here in between this biscuit. It feels weighty. It feels good. Let's see. Oh. Hmm. I'll tell you right now. In the return to the taste mobile 2.0, we're starting with flames. This is also one of the biggest chicken biscuits I have ever seen at a fast food place. Oh. Oh. I gotta put her away. She's making me think things, so I gotta put her away. That is getting an easy 9.4. That is... That is flames, but now. Oh no, she's getting dirty in here. Now this has some glaze to it. Oh, oh man, oh man, oh man. Hardee's. I don't know if this is a limit time offer kind of thing. This needs to be a permanent fixture. That sauce that is just absolutely sticking and hitting all the right notes. Oh my God. This is better than chicken biscuit. Mmm. I am giving that. I'm giving that a 9.8. If you guys need some breakfast, 
You're a fan of the chicken breakfasts as I spit up everywhere. You need to take yourself to Hardee's. This is a revelation. I'm gonna need to do a Wendy's versus Hardee's breakfast showdown because I was not ready for this. It was early in the morning. I wasn't expecting my life to be changed, but you never know. The Lord work in mysterious ways, as I've been told. But we're not done. We got to get a little bit more uh, sweet action to the breakfast game. We have just driven through what, in my opinion, is the donut mecca. Krispy Kreme. And before I pop open and tell you guys what I got, we're just going to zoom in on the on the best thing you can get. If this is what you get under your Christmas tree in the winter, you won Christmas. It doesn't matter. Just, just, oh, oh God. A dozen beautiful children lined up, ready. They know what they were put on this earth for. They were put on this earth to spread beautiful joy. Give me a moment. Now, in order to compare to the other donut, I do need to take a bite of this. Um, we are not going to discuss the fact I am the only one in the household and there's 12 donuts. That, that you know, no one needs to discuss that. Oh. Oh, my God. Krispy Kreme has perfected the glazed donut game. I don't think you can do better than that. You can make them bigger. I, I'm going to down one of these in about six bites easy. Um, but other than that, they don't get much better than that. Um, see how many days it takes me to eat those. All right. Now, first thing I got that was calling my name that was on the menu, cake batter donut. So let's, oh, that, that, that is, um, crispy. That reminds me a little bit of Dunkin'. And that's not a compliment. You should glaze every donut Krispy Kreme without fit. There's no reason not to. Um, this looks like, oh, oh, God. Looks like a child created it with their, uh, Easy Bake Oven. That's what it looks like. And they have a hole in it. Oh, did they not fill it? Oh, I don't think they filled it with cake batter. I think it's supposed to be... Oh, my God. Hmm. Don't judge a book by its cover. Oh, man. They absolutely... I don't know if you can see this. But I believe the entire inside is supposed to be filled with like cake batter or something and it's only at the very very back end so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna break this open there it is okay yeah they filled it on the back end oh oh my crispy cream i apologize i was disrespectful out of line, untoward, um, uneducated, ignorant, blasphemous, whatever word, this donut is hot fire. Now, if you glaze this up too, it'd be wild, but it's getting a solid. This has been a great return to the tasting mobile, by the way. Um, but I'm going to give this a solid like 9.1. This is great. Now, if you're not a big fan of a sugar overload, you're not going to like this. Um, but let me let me shove this bad boy back in my bag. Because I also got a beverage. Let me move some things around. It is called... Um, what is it called again? The, the Summertime Lemonade Chiller. Thank you. Beautiful camera lady, as always. Um, I mean, it, it is a thick lemonade. Um... I don't know how else to explain it, but let's see what it tastes like. Mmm. That's pretty good. It has an actual 
So what I find is a lot of times when I drink lemonades, it is sugary, but I lose that lemon bite because it is so sugary. This one, you still get it. I'm a huge fan of this. Um, not as good as other things we've tasted today, um, but I'm gonna give this a solid like 7.2. This is, this is pretty good for a breakfast um, sugary beverage. And that wraps up our return to the tasting mobile. And it came back fire, ready to go. Hardy's pumping out tremendous breakfast sandwiches, specifically the chicken sandwich, whether it was the chicken biscuit or the chicken waffle and then Krispy Kreme. Um, your donuts, I am going to offend some people, but I think they're the best in the game. I, I, I think they're pretty difficult to beat regardless of, of you know, whether it's a chain or whether it's a mom and pop type shop. Don't come at me. I know we're going to be upset, but Krispy Kreme is top line and that drink wasn't bad at all. So great return. Uh, let me know if there's any other uh, promotional items out there you need me to try and review. I know Burger King has something with a chicken sandwich, but let me know. Drop it in the comments. Uh, but until next time, this was T-Jax on some breakfast items.